getting all classy up in this place. Hey everybody, this is James and welcome to YouTube Suggestions 27. This is my first attempt at making this a monthly thing, so hopefully I'm not biting off more than I can chew. If you are not familiar with YouTube Suggestions, this is where I take a look at, well, six channels really. There are five featured channels that are all under 25,000 subscribers, then later we'll take a quick look at the sixth channel, which is over 25,000 subs. Uh, this time around we'll be concentrating on one of my favorite kinds of channels, travel channels. It's been tough for travel channels the last few months, but these folks have managed to keep putting out some good stuff, uh, sometimes having to break out some extra creativity. So let's not waste any more time. Travel over to the Suggestion Monkey. <laughs> New Jersey, Red and TJ take us along with their new Camp 400 travel trailer as they travel across the U.S. The married couple has a long-term goal of traveling to all 50 states, as well as every U.S. national park, and they've already made quite a dent in that mission. Along with their home state of New Jersey, they have videos from New York, Pennsylvania, South Carolina, Florida, and Georgia. As they gain experience from traveling by RV, they also share tips and tricks for anybody planning on doing the same thing. They're also known to occasionally pop up with a live stream. Red and TJ are fairly new to YouTube, uploading for the first time in June of 2020 and have gained just over 1,200 subscribers at the time I'm making this. They've built up a pretty good archive in the last few months. Uh, I'd recommend starting with their visit to the Pez Candy Dispenser Collection and Visitor Center. I thought that was a fun one. They also have some videos from Gettysburg, which is on my bucket list. You might also enjoy their tour of the Finger Lakes wineries along the Cayuga Lake Wine Trail that's your thing. They are off to a great start, so go check them out. Based in Portugal, Travel Experiences takes a different approach to their videos from most other travel channels. While they don't offer much in the way of commentary, they concentrate on using videos and photos to capture the beauty and unique sides of places around the world. Now, I'm not exaggerating when I say around the world either. They have videos from Luxembourg, Prague, Washington DC, Venice, London, and that's just scratching the surface. They do visit well-known places like Piccadilly Circus in London, but they also feature smaller sites like a Norwegian restaurant or small lakes. Uh, travel Experiences has gained over 5,300 subscribers since they first uploaded in October of 2012. In fact, you might want to check out the first upload sometime as they give a walking tour of Boston, Massachusetts, which includes a quick look at Bull and Finch Pub, which was used for exterior shots on the TV show Cheers. Of more recent videos, they have a great one from their plane as they are flying into Luxembourg. But really, you can't go wrong. There is almost a decade of an archive to go through with some great videos and scenery. Go check them out and see what you think. Anthony and Angie are based out of Norway, but like all good travel channels, their videos are from wherever they hang their hat. Anthony and Angie make great use of drone shots, particularly on scenic beaches and places like Portugal and Thailand. And their shots really make their thumbnails stand out, too. On the ground, they do a great job of showing different sites and their lists of top things to do, even taking a look at some of the nightlife in their travels. As good as all their videos are, the way they capture the beaches and the ocean really seems to stand out. They offer some spectacular views. Anthony and Angie Traveling uploaded their first video in March of 2019. At this point, there isn't a huge archive to go through, but there are some impressive views there that have helped them gain almost 2,000 subscribers at the time I'm making this. I'd recommend starting with some great videos they came out with from Portugal in recent weeks, or just go back to the very beginning and start in Thailand, including one giving a look at the best party street in Bangkok. Something tells me that's a bold statement to make. Wherever you start, go give them a look and see what you think. I am willing to bet 
that there isn't a channel that has more fun doing what they do than travel to her taste. Glenn and Sarah are from the United Kingdom, but almost every place they go, they say they want to move there. That's easy to believe, as they have been to some incredible places. They have a lot of fun visiting everything from water parks to safaris, and even give us a look at some Game of Thrones filming locations. The current global situation has given them some problems, and they have been stuck where they are a couple of times, but they always make the best of a bad situation. Travel Tour Taste is uploading their one-year anniversary as I make this, uploading for the first time in April of 2020, and getting over 2,500 subscribers in that time. Many of their videos are from Bulgaria, where they found out there are some pretty incredible prices on McDonald's food. That was in a video titled Sunny Beach Bulgaria Part 4, and McDonald's prices weren't the only thing up in the air in that one. You might also check out Malta Mdina Game of Thrones for the Game of Thrones locations, along with other great sites around the city. It's a really fun channel, so go give them a look. From my home state of Texas, we find a family of YouTubers going by the collective name of Living Coast to Coast. Rick and Lisa with their kids Amber, Kayla, and Elizabeth started out making videos for their own enjoyment but decided to share them on YouTube for others to see. And there is a lot to see. This well-traveled family has been everywhere from their home state of Texas up to Montana, over to New York, and everywhere in between. You not only get to see all the great natural and man-made sites, but you'll also experience a lot of teasing and silliness from a fun group of people. Living Coast to Coast uploaded their first video in February of 2017 and have gained almost 3,000 subscribers since then. It's tough to say where to start, but they have some great videos from Wyoming recently if you want to check them out. If ASMR is your thing, they also have some really relaxing videos from Yellowstone, and they even give a look at the National Sprint Car Museum. If you want something more on the silly side, well, there's plenty of that too. There's four years of an archive to jump into, so go give them a look, and don't forget to tell them a view from the middle sent you. That's our five featured channels this time around. If you aren't familiar with these channels, at least go give them a look. You can get to their channel by clicking the icon in the upper right hand corner or in the description. Uh, it's tough for small channels to grow these days, so it's always good to do what we can to help each other out. If you aren't aware, subscribing is absolutely free on YouTube. Speaking of which, if you aren't already subscribed here, you can do so by clicking the double arrow one way sign in the bottom right hand corner or the red button on the front page. If you don't subscribe, it will cause a global pandemic and nobody will be able to travel anywhere. Well, that sounds familiar. Before we close things out, let's take a look at the sixth channel. As I mentioned before, this is a channel over 25,000 subscribers, but it might still be one you aren't familiar with, and, and you may want to go give it a look. The sixth channel this time around is Jumping Places. Jumping Places is hosted by Chris and Carol, a married couple originally from England and Brazil, respectively. They have been traveling full-time since 2019, and while the pandemic has certainly thrown them a few curves, they have still managed to share some amazing places. They actually spent a lot of time in the Philippines, kind of getting stuck there because of everything going on, but they made the most of their time there by helping a place called the Communal Pot that helped feed primarily hungry kids that were hit hard by the pandemic. You'll find more recent videos from Mexico that are really good. Go back before all the lockdowns and such started, and they have great videos from Sri Lanka, India, and even a trip to Cuba. The first upload from the channel actually goes back to June of 2017 and Jumping Places has grown to over 136,000 subscribers since then. There are some incredible videos on their channel, so go check them out. Alright, that's YouTube Suggestions 27. Stick around until the end screen to see the names of the channels I use clips of at the beginning of the video. If you want to see more reviews of small channels, check out the YouTube Suggestions playlist. I think we've traveled far enough this month. Lori, take us out. It's a wrap.